Afternoon, everybody. Welcome to Choochin' on a Wednesday afternoon. Where are you going, huh? <laughs> Took off like a bat out of hell. There's the Missy Jen. And what are we doing today, Jen? We had our doctor follow-up appointment. We'll be talking about that on tomorrow morning's Chooch. But what are we doing? Hmm? Yeah. What are you smiling about, huh? I can't Look at Smiley, it's huh? It's a secret. <laughs> It's a government secret. All right. I well, we, we kind of went for it this year. We were very happy with our crop of big tomatoes last year, right? We didn't right. plan any of the little teeny tiny ones. And Jen's already got two three plant, two up there, one, there. one over here. One here. Yes, yeah, so we have Ace, Early Girl, and uh, the, uh, what's the big boy? The beef. Beef steak. Yeah. We got uh, starting to six rain. Six big beef. Six beef steak. And two early girl. Just to try them. And then one big boy and one ace. Cool. That's it. So it's uh, going to do a little time waster. I think Jen's going to have to band and chip and run inside. Maybe she'll come visit me in the workshop because I'm on a. Wednesday afternoon time waster here. Come on into the shop. <laughs> oh, what a crazy dog. You guys remember when, uh, last year, I think it was last year, might even been the year before. Guess what I just dug out of the uh, dug out of the closet here? Storage. Our little uh, our little radio station FM transmitter and uh, just for shits and giggles one day I decided to see if we could build our own little radio station here on the Rancho and it actually worked out the videos in there I think it's called uh, KRR something like uh, K Rosie Rancho KRRJ or some Rosie and Jan or some kind of crap on there I'll put it in the description box show building it. So I thought today it might be not fun to fire it up. I have the uh, Magnavox over here. I'm kind of between projects right now. I don't really have anything on the bench. We finished the Allied. We're just waiting to do a uh, Adventures in uh, Vintage Audio Listening here with the uh, SMQ300B, the Pioneer that we restored. Doesn't that look beautiful? Woo! So I thought today it might be fun to put on the uh, Magnavox and see if we can pick up a signal and then go inside on the Sherwood in the kitchen and see if we uh, can pick up a signal. So let's go ahead and uh, let's get her set up. We've got our input feed here um, with our 3.5 mm jack. We'll take uh, we'll take output from the computer. We'll get something from the YouTube audio library. We'll transmit it over the air and we'll see if we can pick it up over there. We'll see how well this uh, this is held up here, huh? Let me get things set sure up. Sure as hell don't have an on off switch. That would be a little too fancy. So just crimp this power positive lead together here. That should hold okay. And we've got our uh, input connectors there. Turn that upside down and sit there. We'll fire up the computer here. I'm gonna need two hands for this. We'll get this set up and we'll get uh, we'll get a little Tchaikovsky going, huh? Like we always do. It's another great, uh, more great music to test out the audio. Why are you yakking in German? Hmm? Are you frustrated? I'm saying it in German so you don't know what I'm saying. Then that means you're saying something bad about me I'm again. Not you do that. About you. I don't yak in Chinese about you. I'm huh? not saying anything about you. I'm just saying something. I'm a chi guai ni, huh? Han ma fang. Jin tian is fei cha ma fang. Huh? Right. Yeah. You're so you keep yakking right. that German, sister. Right. Correct. Absolutely. What happened to your pants? Did the rats attack? <laughs> I was out. The hell, the hell you got there, honey? Huh? You like a uh, turn around in the light. Let them see you. Let them appreciate the full beauty of that. Huh? We're not too cheap here. <laughs> this is like Charles Dickens. It was the best of times. It was the worst of times, right? <laughs> um. All right. 
I watched the a movie on a famous banking family. The Rothschild. They had a lot of money, but they pretended not to. That's you. And <laughs> no, no, Jen's a Rothschild. <laughs> Holy shit! Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, I'm out of here. You come out and visit any time, okay? Uh, <laughs> it's coming through a little rough, but she's coming through. She bangs, boys. She bangs. Let's see if we can... You never know what frequency is going to show up on it. Playing 1812 Overture. I know you got you guys are saying, Rosie, you do the coolest shit on your channel all the time. <laughs> Transmitter's working, huh? It's very sensitive to direction. Let's go inside and see if we can pick it up inside on the uh, Sherwood in the kitchen. There she is on the intercom. Let's see if we can get her tuned in on the Sherwood here. We're gonna get able to get it in there. Probably have to increase the battery power a little bit. KRRJ is on the air. Just got to figure out how we can get a little more juice to that. I mean, we'll get another battery hooked up. Oh, can't seem to get much pickup. I've doubled the voltage on that. About 199, yeah, 100 on the FM dial. Let's go inside and try it again. There she is. We got success, guys. All we needed was a clear frequency. They're coming in clean. Kind of cool, huh? about 20 25 30 feet there i'm next thing i'm going to build a stereo one for the rancho sounds pretty good huh jen 
compared to the usual crap we broadcast last year. Alright, let's uh, do a few more tutus and uh, wrap it up. I know, I love to do this kind of shit. It drives Missy Jen crazy when I do this crazy mad professor bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> what I did was raise the level of the uh, broadcasting unit up a little higher. This is the important coil that specifically uh, wound to FM frequencies there. So what we're doing is feeding Tchaikovsky in here. And then it's actually broadcasting, transmitting radio waves are going through the air being picked up by this over here, our uh, Magnavox. Coming in pretty clean, I'd say. Huh? For a 50 cent transmitter. <laughs> I'll tell you, Prepper's gonna love me if the shit hits a fan. Between making moonshine, and uh, making transmitters. Let's go inside and wrap it up. Missy Jen KJJR is on the air again. Jen's like, holy shit, save me. <laughs> She's had it with this crap. <laughs> All day, every day, huh? <laughs> Tell me you still love me. I still love you. <laughs> She's heard this song so many times, driving her nuts. Success. How are you, everybody? Thanks for being along. Missy Jen only lets me do this about two hours a week and then... <laughs> Told you it's a time waster on a Wednesday afternoon.